hello guys so welcome back to the channel we just got the package today from ebay um i'll put the link down in the description section but first uh, let's open up the package and see what it is and uh it's going to be an accessory for the homa h2 so let's go ahead see what we got in this box there Oops. make sure carefully we get that pretty sharp knife so oops here we go <laughs> i'm already dropping stuff i am dropping stuff we got some mounting houseware right there and you might have guessed I got mud flaps from eBay left front they seem like pretty good quality four of them and these are the mud flaps that will go in the back somewhere here I'm not exactly sure how but uh, I'll figure out some way to mount them on there and I'll be right back so this is what we get uh, you get the box you get four of the mod flaps and then you also get the mounting hardware. Take this out. Take a look. There's slippery here. And these are going to be for the rear, I would imagine. Front, right, right, rear. Here you have front and this last one is left hand rear. So there you have it guys. I will try to figure out how to mount these on the Hummer and uh, I'll show you guys the finished product. Be back. Hello guys. It's been a couple of days since uh, the first video I did of the unboxing of the mod flaps and right now i have the mod flaps mounted on the homa h2 and i think they look really phenomenal uh, let's go around so i can show you guys exactly what they look like here you have the front one sorry about the dirt in the wheel well um i had this cleaned up a couple of days ago then we had snow and the snow melted so my pressure washer the pressure washer has been put away so you can see the front here is the rear it uh, gives a little bit more coverage as you guys can see so hopefully that will prevent some more of the uh, dirt from hitting the side of the body because these tires are just so wide uh, that they go beyond the fender flare so that's what it looks like uh, this one I think I don't have it mounted really nice you guys can see it's a bit uh, skewered. It doesn't look very level like the one on the right. But that's what it looks like mounted. And of course you have the other one here in the front. So I looked uh, on the internet to see if uh, anybody had like uh, instructions on how to mount these uh, fender flares. And I did not find any mounting instructions. But when I got to mounting the uh, fender flares uh, on the vehicle, all what I did was I actually, for the first, this top two, I used the same mounting hardware that was used, uh, that was on there before. So you just pop it out, pop it out, and then you put the fender flare and then you remount, you know, those, uh, those uh, mounting uh, 
devices whatever they call them <laughs> i'm not sure i had the option also of using screws that came with the uh, flaps with the mod flaps but i just prefer to use uh, the same mounting hardware because um, it just I, I i just think it's uh, solid enough and down there there is a screw and that screw comes with a clip let's see if we can see the clip from behind here it's kind of hard but there's a metal clip right there uh, i might have to relocate that i think i didn't push that far enough upward um, so that that little clip is what uh holds this part of the fender of the of the mud flap in place so <clears throat> that's a job i have to revisit all in all i'm happy with uh, the outcome with the way everything looks uh, i might have to just get that one you know in the right position here in a few minutes i think i could do a better job so yeah there you go uh this is what the mud flaps look like for the front i just had to turn the tire uh turn it in uh, one direction or the other and that gives you enough clearance to go ahead and use the mounting hardware that's the screws that come with the mud flaps to directly mount the front ones uh, on the plastic right there i didn't put any metal in the backing so uh, try to go very carefully and don't overdo it that way uh, you get some very good uh, grip on the on the mud flap so uh, I'm, I'm also very pleased with the way it fits flush as you guys can see it fits really nicely so uh, you can tell that it's, this was purpose designed for the Homa H2 uh, everything fits really flush and I'm pleased with that let's see if you guys can see something here so well thanks for watching that's what I had to share with you guys today uh, the mod flaps that I installed on the Homa H2 and I will put a link to the particular mod flaps I used down in the description. Bye for now and catch you guys on the next one.